filling up the beer. Back tape side, you can tell, can't you? Well, I say just a few beers, literally all the Heineken's they had in the supermarket. So, lads, lads, lads. In my hotel room, I smashed my head twice. Fuck. Cheers. So, what's the plan, Governor? Don't know, a few Heineken's. Mm hmm. Tim, we're going to England tomorrow. Gotta to use that laptop, I've got to use the flights. No problem. Back to Luton. Uh, yeah. Been a short vacation, probably somewhere hot. Then back to England for a couple of days, have some business to take care of. Then I think we'll go to India. India? You ever been to India? You want to go? No. Too it's bad. actually one of the places I really don't want to go. Too bad. Have you been to India? No. Do you want to go? Somewhere new. To get off the list. Shouldn't I have vaccinations and stuff? If you didn't get them done, it's not my problem. Have you got vaccinations? I'm immune to everything. just to deal with the news that I'm going to India. So without Andrew being here and the news that I was, I'm now going to India, um, it came as no surprise that I drank myself into a bit of a uh, stupor last night, mainly just to deal with it. The rejection, the fear of the shit. Because going to India, that's, that's, that is literally gonna be hell. I can't, I can't handle a frappe. I mean, it's too, the milk and the ice, it's, too much for my my stomach. It's pathetic, I know. But when I go to a Lydian, I'm a bit. I'm, I go crazy sometimes. I have a jail crazy, but I suffer. But I think oh, it's going to be worth it. I'm not going to. I'm not going to order a korma and be a puff. I'll, I'll go mental and have a jail crazy or a Dan sack. Tikka masala, average. Boona, definitely. But Boona comes at a price, as as they all do. Breathe you. Walk. I'm screwed, absolutely screwed. And it's not like when you get the shits, it's gonna be nice, you know, porcelain toilet. I've seen Slumdog Millionaire, they're shitting in wooden shacks. They don't even wipe. So, I don't know, I really don't know how I'm gonna survive this, we'll, we'll have to see. Maybe I just won't eat, that's a, quite a logical no, I, don't, I like a poppadom. Can't go wrong with a poppadom or a nah. But they're inescapable, the shits. They are inescapable. There's no way you can avoid the shits in India. It's a fact. Is there? Is, is, if anyone has any advice, please let me know. Please. I'm, I'll, I will pay for advice. I won't. I haven't got any money. Uh, anyway, so I woke up feeling pretty awful this morning. Very young over. Um, so, here's an episode of Andrew talking about people who also feel quite awful in the morning. That's people who get their drinks spiked. Enjoy. Nice little smoking area. Yeah. Nasty things happen here, don't they? What do you mean, Romania? Nah, just in smoking areas. You know, this is where you hear the last memories of girls who've had their drinks spiked and blokes who have got too bad. No, no girl's ever had her drink spiked. I'm tired of hearing, I had my drink spiked. That is the biggest crock of shit that every fucking 19 year old says. No one spiked your drink. Okay, first thing, let's look at alcohol tolerances. If you have half a brain, you understand that alcohol tolerances change day by day. Judged on how much food you've eaten that day, how hydrated you are, have you drunk water, how much sleep you've had, your body weight, people's body weights fluctuate. So if I can drink 10 shots of vodka one day, maybe the next day I can only have six or seven. That's how it is. But everyone's spiked drink story is the same, everyone. Well, I went out, no, I went out, I had one drink. No, you didn't. Don't lie to me, don't lie to yourself. You didn't have one drink. You, you had one drink at home, and then one drink in the taxi, and then only three drinks in the club, and you passed out. How do you know how strong those drinks were? Let me tell you how, let me tell you how drink spiking works. If I'm a guy who wants to spike a drink, my intention is to have sex with you. That's my intention. So what I'll do is, maybe at a house party, 
Maybe, if, or maybe in a house there's only three people or something, I might spike your drink and you'll pass out or something. The, my, the last thing I'm aiming to achieve by spiking your drink is you acting like a drunk fool, hanging around with your stupid friends, throwing up on yourself, taking your shoes off, getting your ugly ass feet out, and wandering to a taxi. That's not the intention of anyone who spiked anyone's drink. And that's how every story ends. Oh, he spiked my drink and I was so fucked. Oh my God, and my friends put me in text. I got home and I was so fucked. Why would someone give you that? Well, who's going around going, you know what, I'm gonna get, I'm get a girl and spike her drink and make her drunk. Everyone's trying to get drunk anyway. But it doesn't even make sense. You didn't have your drink spike. You drank too much because you're an irresponsible dickhead and you want to blame someone else for it. You're irresponsible. You're fucking stupid. You don't even know what you're drinking half the time. You're downing pints at random and you're surprised you got fucking drunk. Fucking, how can you be surprised? You're thick as fuck. No one spiked your drink for a second. Don't pretend they did. That's the biggest crock of shit. If I had a girlfriend and, 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 and we'd been together, let's say six months, and she's a nice, lovely girl, and then one day I get a phone call or she comes home or whatever, she's covered in sick, her friends are like, oh, she's too drunk, da, da, da. And she looks like shit, and she wakes up the next day and goes, someone spiked my drink. Do you know what I'd say? You're dumped. Because you're obviously irresponsible and can't control yourself. See ya, bitch. No, but it wasn't my fault. I only had one drink. Da, da, da. Don't chat shit to me. Don't chat shit to yourself. You made it back here in one piece. Unless you've been, have you been, has someone come inside you? No, check, no. Okay, so no one spiked your fucking drink. You're fine. You drank too much and you're annoying. Get out. Bollocks. No one spikes anyone's drinks. Tired of fucking girls. Oh, someone spiked my drink. And it's fucking because they're stupid and drunk out of fucking minds. No one spikes anyone's drinks. That's not a real thing. It's bullshit. Drink up, man. Ha 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 ha!